guys welcome back to my channel and if you're new I'm Christina and this is my channel I tend to wing it um, this tutorial was intended to be a, a New Year's Eve look but I was sick for the last couple of days so I said what the heck I'm still gonna do the look and I'm just gonna say that I am making my New Year's Eve look 364 days early so if you like this look and you want to see how I did it, then just keep watching. Okay, the first thing that I did was I primed my eyes with the Soft Ochre Paint Pot by MAC. I just basically covered the entire lid up to the brow bone area. And the next thing I'm going to do is go in with this Real Techniques Angled Shadow Brush. And I'm going to dip that into the black out of the Mega Pro palette. And I'm just going to keep that on the crease area and I'm going to use a very light hand. So I'm just going to sweep it across and just use like the windshield wiper motions. And I'll clean the brush off if I have to because I got too much product on. And I'm just going to keep sweeping that across until I get a nice little fade going on. Next, I'm going to go in with another Real Techniques brush, and this one is the Base Shadow Brush. I'm going to go back in with that black because, as you can see, this one here is a little bit more thinner. And I'm just going to concentrate that right in the crease area to deepen that up some. And then I'll go back in if I need to, which I do, and just blend that out a little bit. Now I'm going to take my Urban Decay Black Velvet Liner and I'm going to run that right below the bottom lash line. And then I'm going to line my top and bottom waterline. Next, I'm going to go in with a pencil brush, and this is a Sonia Kashuk uh, pencil brush, and I'm going to go into the black with a very light hand. Just dip that in there, and I'm going to run that along the bottom lash line where I place the liner. And then I'm going to dip that brush into brown, and I'm going to run that along where the uh, black stops, because that's going to help me from looking like I have raccoon eyes. So see how that kind of helped it uh, smoke it out some? Then with a fluffy brush, I'm going to go in with vanilla, just a very light amount, and that's going to be my brow bone highlight. Next, I'm going to use this uh, base, and it is like a white gold, cool toned gold color, and this one is called City Color, and it's in white gold. And it's just a mousse-like texture uh, that's just going to help the uh, shadow that I'm going to lay down uh, pop a little more. So I'm going to take uh, just a synthetic brush and dip that into the base and just pat some on the lid. Then I'm going to use my ring finger and just blend it out. Now I'm going to go in with a small shader brush, and this one is Coastal Scents. And there's not a number on it, but I'm going to mix sand and vanilla. Give that a little tap, and I'm just going to pat that over the white gold base. And I'm going to mix sand and vanilla again. Give it another tap, and that's going to go on the tear duct area. Now I'm 
gonna do some wing liner with my Prestige Liquid Liner in black. And I'm just gonna wing that out. I'm gonna use my Bare Minerals Flawless Definition Mascara. And just coat the bottom and top lashes. I did put on my false lashes off camera just for time's sake. I just used some basic false lashes. They were Ardell's, I think, the Demi Wispies. And the next thing I'm going to use is some blush. And I'm going to keep the blush very natural. So I'm going to go in with Classic. It's a Tarte blush. And this is what it looks like. And I'm going to go in with a cheek brush by Coastal Scents. And I am going to use a very light amount just because I got so much going on with the eyes. I don't want to take away from that. And just keeping that on the apples of my cheeks. Very natural. And then you can't go without your highlight, so I'm going to use my MAC Mineralized Skin Finish in Soft and Gentle and my Tarte Brush that I always use from the Carried Away palette, which was from a Christmas collection several years ago. And I'm just going to highlight the cheekbones. my nose, chin, and my forehead. All right, I wasn't sure what to do with the lip color because of this eye color. It's a little bit new to me, so I said I'm just going to go all out. If it doesn't match, whatever. So I'm going to use this Wet n Wild Fergie lipstick in Penthouse Sweet. And I just messed that up, but it's okay. And it is this bright pink color. I'm just going to put that all over my lips. top that off with a Kat Von D lip gloss and this one is in Foiled Love I believe and it's just a shimmery pink color similar to that lipstick it's just got shimmer in it guys that completes the look I hope that you like this video if you did give me a thumbs up and make sure you subscribe down below if you aren't already and I will see you in my next video happy new year and I hope that you have a great 2015 bye